Hello guys, what's up? My name is Hollow, and today I was hoping to do the new pack. I'm gonna try to do it, but I'm having problems downloading it. I pre-ordered it and it's not showing up. So I don't know what's going on with that. I've been like scouring Twitter, trying to figure it out. And apparently for some people, they have the same issue and they just loaded their game and it worked. I did that, didn't work, but it did say it was downloading. So hopefully it'll be here soon. I don't know, it's already like two o'clock. So we'll see what's going on. But anyways, I'm gonna go in and review a couple things that I forgot in yesterday's video. And hopefully once we're done with that, I'll be able to get into the actual new pack. So we have the same skin skin details for the face that we had for babies except for like the dark ones so the one that was like on the forehead and the strawberry on the back of the neck they both don't show up but all the reddish ones did and they have other swatches they're not just all red but we also have some for the body which makes me think that I probably missed that on infants so <laughs> I might have to go back and check that too but there's also stretch marks which I was super excited for but I'm honestly kind of disappointed they look just kind of painted on I don't really like the way they look so I'll probably stick to my CC for stretch marks but we also got an update to likes and dislikes so we can now have 50 instead of what 20 we had before so moving on to build by we have three items i missed the first one is this giant llama which is so freaking cute there's a lot of amazing swatches it's really cute and i just i love it so much and i don't know how i forgot it and then the other one is this lamp which is so adorable the foxes are just so precious and then the final thing i forgot was this fence and the gate that comes with it and they're basically playpen fences but they do have a couple swatches that are a little bit more neutral where they just focus on one color but the cool thing about these is the gate because with this gate you can actually set a specific unlock which is child proofing or well, baby proofing actually the baby proofing will actually lock it so that your babies cannot get out whatsoever but if you put toddlers in toddlers can still get out which is why it's called baby proofing and not child proofing because the toddlers can actually escape which i think is really fun but anyways i am gonna go check on my game again and hopefully i'll be able to get back in and actually play the new pack so we'll either be back with that or me crying aggressively because I spent $40 I'm not getting back. Okay, we are in business, it's here. If anyone else pre-ordered or you ordered it and it wasn't showing up, maybe just load your game and see if it's there for you because I didn't do anything other than just load, close, and reload the game and now it's working. The EA app never told me it was there, it just it just works. So I, I, I don't know, EA app is so different from Origin and like a lot of people complained about Origin and said that it was bad, but I never had any problems with it, but I have had hella problems since starting with the EA app. So I'm salty. I don't, I do not like the EA app at all. Uh, but anyways, growing together, we can start now, finally. Okay, so let's go ahead and go through it. And we're just gonna do like the review for this one. I'll start gameplay in the next one. I need to get my CC back in. I'm not gonna play with mods right now because all the mods probably need to be updated and stuff, but I'm gonna put my CC back in so that we can actually make the characters look the way I want them to <laughs> when we get into making characters for this series. So let's go ahead and do the overview. Welcome to The Sims 4 Growing Together. A lasting impact. Key choices and milestones will help to shape who your Sims are, unlock and change personality traits throughout your Sims' lives as they cope with midlife crises. Crises. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot crises is the word. <laughs> as they cope with midlife crises, respond to family requests to move in, and more. Self-discovery is a lifelong journey. Hold, wait, hold on. Family requests to move in? Not just to visit? So your family can just randomly ask to live with you? So does that mean like your elders will be like, hey, I'm old now, can I come live with you? That would be so cool. If like parents ask to come live with their kids. Oh, I love that. I love that. I hope that's a thing. I hope that's not just poor wording. Uh, but I am like something that we're going to talk about uh, probably throughout the series is there's a lot of stuff that I know is coming to this pack that I am really mad is in the pack and not base game update. A few things that said in here, milestones and unlocking and changing personality traits, that shit should be in game. Like normally that shouldn't be locked behind a paywall. That's just like basic gameplay on like how your sim works. That's There's no reason for that to be a pack specific item. That should be just base game. But anyways, moving on. Perfect for families. Located along an ocean bay, San Sequoia was once a small fishing village and has grown into a bustling town. It features quiet suburbs, a lively rec center, a tight-knit community, and even an influential local family. The Robleses? Robles? Ro <laughs> I think it's Robles's, I think. I don't know. Social dynamics. Sometimes Sims just click. Your Sim might have natural social chemistry with a Sim they meet at a party, or they might naturally clash. Your Sim will now have preferences that determine which Sim they are socially compatible with and which Sim they are more likely... It just cuts off. Okay, cool. Um, <laughs> anyway, again, another feature that should be in base game should not be locked behind a pack. Family ties. The bonds between your related Sims are important and complex as they experience life together there will be opportunities for both drama and unity that will affect family dynamics and Sims' relationships with their family members. This one, 
I would like it to be base game, but I understand it being pack specific. And since it's specifically tied to families, it fits this family themed pack. If it was like something that happened with like every sim, that I don't know, I feel like that could be, that would have to be base game. But since this is specifically tied to the families, I feel like it's acceptable to be behind the paywall. I still don't like it, but you know, I'll give them a pass on it. But yeah, so there's lots of cool stuff and I'm excited. So let's go ahead and get in and check out Cass. Let's go ahead and check them out. We'll go in order. Any new skin details? Oh, okay, we got a lot. All right, these are nice, but again, so mad they're locked behind the pack. Like these are freckles, they're freckles. Like why can't we have freckles just normal? How are you gonna lock facial features behind a paywall? I hate that. They did the same thing with high school years because this is the high school years one. Uh, personally, I'm not a huge fan of how these freckles look. I just, I mean, I just don't really like EA's freckles in general. If you like them, there's new freckles. There's five new freckle options, which is awesome. Oh my God, we have moles. I love moles. If, you, <laughs> if you've ever seen me make a cinnamon cast, I love moles. I love putting moles on people and I love the experience sporadic random patterning when it's just like one here it's not really my thing but when there's like a bunch of them that looks cool and that's super nice i just noticed that you can layer the other moles with these group moles i like that a lot it adds a more variety so it looks like these group moles may be a separate oh no they're the same as the cheek one. Oh, that's sad Okay, whatever. So we've got more for the other side as well. Even more, we have like upper forehead moles. Oh, look at that, that's so cute. Okay, hold on, I gotta remove, I, there's so much going on. Again, moles, why, moles, why? I hate that, like this stuff should be base game. There's no reason for this to be paywalled. I hate that, but this is a super cute little birthmark. I love that it's like a little heart shape. It's absolutely adorable. I'm gonna use that so much. And then these are the other base game ones that I sort of zoomed through at the beginning. We got a new forehead scar that's the one that the father from the michaelsons has again why is it behind the paywall mouth scars Ooh. oh it's a chin scar okay cool so we have a little chin scar as well that's awesome i hope that works for kids too because my brother like he busted open his chin twice as a kid so he, he had chin scars for a while okay so we got eight new hairs we got this one here which is super cute actually I really like that. I'm I'm very happy with the new Afro texture hairs they've been putting in. I don't use Maxis hairs or Maxis match hairs. I mean, except for like a couple of the lock hairstyles I'll do, but um, I don't really, I just don't vibe with Maxis. I prefer, I prefer Alpha, but I am very happy with these. These look so much better than they ever did before. And they actually look nice. This hair looks nice. It's not just better. It's actually nice. I like it quite a bit. And I like that they gave two versions. They have one that's just like a basic headband and one that's a colorful patterned headband because you know they don't let you separate your headband like your headband color from your hair color so it's at least nice they give you different options for that um we have this one just really cute as well it looks really nice i like that they added in that little bit of the part line that's really cute detail we've got these buds which i might actually use as i said i usually use locks but i sometimes use the braids too and i actually really like this one we've got these buns which are so adorable oh my god i love the braids in the back that's so cute i love this this is a beautiful hair it almost makes me wish I used Max's match hair. <laughs> <laughs> legitimately this hair alone almost makes me wish i used maxis match hair like that's gorgeous so pretty okay um then we have this one short curls again very nice very nice short curls love those then we have these ones which have different color roots so do they all have black roots i wonder okay yeah so for this one they all have black roots but then the top is whatever color you pick and then we have this one which is another cute little bun this pack has a lot of afro textured hair which makes me happy to see it but again it is easy EA putting culture behind a paywall, which sucks because like these are pretty classic ideas of black hair. Like this this bun, I know like four people that are wearing this hairstyle right now. This hair is fairly similar to my own. I mean, my hair is not quite this curly. Um, my my curl patterns are a little looser, but like my hair looks pretty similar to this when I when I wear my hair down. This one I haven't seen it with these braids, but like the space buns, 100% black black hairstyle all the time. You can't simulate yourself in a life simulation game without paying an extra $40 and I, I don't like that. That's what you're gonna hear a lot of for this. These back reviews for me are a lot of complaining because <laughs> like there's so much good stuff in here but I'm always gonna complain about how much it costs because I literally realized last week I have spent more money on this game than the computer I play it on. 
My computer costs like $900. This game I've spent over a thousand dollars on. I think I'm at 1060 right now because I had like I got the deluxe version of the base game and then I have every single pack except Bust the Dust. This game is hella expensive and they're constantly doing these things where they're saying that they're listening to us but the, their way of listening to us is making us pay more to get what we asked for and it's just it's really annoying and I just I have a lot of issues with it. So it's gonna come up a lot during these reviews. But all that complaint being said, this is beautiful. Everything I've seen so far looks really good. I mean, the freckles, I admit, weren't really my style, but they do, like, that's my personal style. I'm not saying they looked bad, but everything I've seen so far looks great. It looks fantastic. This hair is gorgeous, but it's just disappointing that it's a pack and not base game. We have two new hats, apparently. We've got this cute little scarf thing, which is nice. Um, you can kind of see a bun in the back. Anyways, it looks like there's like a bun and then it's tied up with a braid. But um, one thing that is a little sad about this is it's tied to this texture of hair. So if you have a different hair texture, if you have wavy hair, if you have curly hair, this isn't really going to make sense. I think I think they showed in the live stream that this actually reacts when you change hair color. Yeah. So when you change hair color, it does react to it. It's got some cute swatches too. These patterns are really nice. But the unfortunate thing about this is because it's linked with this hair, I can't use this because I don't use Maxis Match stuff. I use Alpha. So that I won't be able to use this for me. But when it's locks and stuff, I can ignore it, but not with that. Um, This hat's super cute. <laughs> These look really nice. The squares in here. If you haven't watched my videos before, I am really big on separation. So like when there's things that look like they're coming off, I really appreciate when you can actually see it lift off. Like when it's flat, it bothers me a lot. With this hat, it's everything's flat but it doesn't look flat like it looks textured I like that it's like it does a much better job than they usually do is what I'm trying to say this is much better than usual when it comes to separating the textures and making them look different even though it's flat same with the rim the rim looks different like yeah if you look over the side you see that it's still flat but it looks like it stands off and I like that so this is done really well for like my sensibilities I like that a lot oh okay so we get one thing we get this new earring oh yeah that's actually really nice and uh, the thing I like the most about it is how small the rings are. If you look at the regular EA rings, look how thick that thing is. <laughs> Even the small one, so thick. Look how thick that hook is. But for this new earring, look how thin. It's beautiful. No new makeup. I'm gonna remove the hat because I just, I want to see this hair. <laughs> it's just so pretty. It's just so pretty. I highly doubt we got any tattoos. We don't usually, so I'm not expecting anything. Yeah, I don't see any. Um, doesn't look like there's any new body hairs, no new scars. Oh, we did get a c-section scar in base game though which is nice i forgot to show that off but here's the new category the skin details that i talked about before so these are all the ones that i showed earlier the body ones and then the stretch marks down here but we did get some new ones with this pack again we got more freckles which is nice we actually have body freckles in the game now which has never been a thing and these are actually cute i, I don't mind this style for a body freckle for the face freckles it felt like a lot but for the body i like it quite a bit then we also got body moles which are also great I'm not super happy with how they're all grouped on the chest and they're not really spread out anywhere else, but I mean, they're not bad. Ooh, okay. So we got a decent number of new tops. Ooh, cozy sweaters. Love that. Cute swatches. Oh, these are nice. So a couple of them have patterned undershirts instead of patterned tops. We've got these patterned tops up here, which are super cute. Uh, I've got this sort of blazer sweater vest combo. Very cute. Nice layering. We've got this shirt that we saw in the trailer. The mom in the trailer wears this. It's pretty cute. Got this new sweater jacket thing very cute these, are, these all look like nice comfy cozy suburban sort of vibes oh uh, you got this hat hat Wow, Jessica, your brain does not work. Uh, we got this new shirt, which is like a knitwear shirt with some different patterns. Oh, this is the elephant one that girl was wearing in the screenshot. Okay. But yeah, um, it looks like they're doing a decent amount of knitwear. Oh my god. I love this. Look at that texture. That looks fabulous. Oh my god. That's beautiful. The texture looks so good on that. Oh my god. I mean, the corset underneath is fine, but like that jacket is gorgeous love that got this sort of top jacket thing which is similar it's similar to the one we got in the fit kit or whatever i don't remember what it's called 
like the, the throwback fit kit that one or maybe that's maybe i'm thinking high school years maybe it looks similar to one in high school years i don't know there's like the same sort of track jacket sort of style but it's nice there's no, the zipper looks great on that look at how textured the zipper is oh my god see there's so much nice stuff that's coming out they're doing they did a really good job with this so far so far everything i'm seeing is done very well i like these so much this is super cute and see there it's that separation that nice little separation between the sweater and the shirt that's what I need. I like it. Oh, we've got some polka dot ones too. Cute. All right. Yeah, these are super cute. The pattern's great. Another sweater. This is so cool. I love this. The two direction. That's really cute. And they've got the patterns on the inside. Nice. These swatches are all really pretty. Oh, we've got a nice simple top. Just seeing those moles made me so happy. I just turned around and I was like, oh, moles. It's just, like, it looks so, it looks so, it looks like a person, you know? Like, I don't know. I have, I have a mole on my back. I have like one like right in the middle of my back. So it's just like, Stuff like this is just like, oh, it's so cool. But you know what? I can't do that if I don't have this pack. <laughs> so again, kind of disappointing. But um, what's going on right there? What is that? Why is it? Do you see that? It's just like poking off really weird right there in the corner. Okay, that's that's a little glitch. But yeah, otherwise the shirt looks great. Um, let's see what the other swatches look like. So it looks like it's all plain, no patterns or anything, which is fine. Still super cute. Got this one, which is like a nice little sweater thing. Again, these like painted on cutout areas look really nice. We've got this one. It's kind of cute. I like that it's only like vaguely see-through. Like you can just barely see the bra or bandeau or whatever she's got underneath there and the swatches are nice too these colors all look really good this is probably my least favorite so far it just looks a little less um defined than everything else but it's not bad this one i don't i just don't understand the shirt are these supposed to be pockets or something like i don't i don't understand the design of this shirt that's like it's not that it's made badly or anything i just don't get this design personally not for me uh, this is gonna be a really long review <laughs> this is gonna be another long one like what i did for cottage living i can feel it already it's taking me so long to go through this anyways we have full body there's a couple simple ones we've got the patterned ones and the plain ones i prefer the patterned ones i think they look a little bit better i like that the collar comes off they're doing a good job with the depth of field because i thought that i actually thought that pocket came off for a second got this dress also looks good again pockets look good they're probably flat too yep they look flat so the depth of field they're getting much better with it because like it actually looks good now so like even if it's painted on it still looks decent which i am so happy about oh this is super cute I love this. Oh, that's so cute. And the swatches are all really nice too. We've got this dress. It looks pretty good. We've got a couple patterned ones, a couple plain ones. And something I'm noticing with this, a lot of these clothes would look great on elders. These things give me more elder vibes. I totally skipped stuff. I, I just skipped two entire things. I just realized. <laughs> my bad. Um, this, oh my god, the bedazzling. Oh, it's like elementary school. I hate it. <laughs> It just took me back. Oh, I don't like that. I mean, not that this is done badly or anything. It just brought up my childhood trauma. So, <laughs> you know, don't want to talk about that. But anyways, um, the rest of this looks great. Like, um, uh, again, the bedazzling, it looks pretty good. I thought this, I actually thought those were on there, but no, they're just painted on. Again, looking good. I'm very, I'm very impressed with their painting this time. Cause usually with every pack, I complain so much about the painted on textures, but brought, they stepped it up with this one. These look so good. Um, personally, I'm just not a fan of this style, but again, something I would definitely use for my elders. Cause like grandmas do this all the time. <laughs> it's like the grandmas who are trying to be hip and fun and they get like the bedazzled shirts and stuff. And you're just like, grandma, why? <laughs> Putting gemstones all over your shirt doesn't make you young again. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, but anyways, it's, it's, it's fun. Let them live. Let them do their thing. This dress looks kind of like a night dress to me almost. But I mean, you could use it for just like regular every day. But it does look kind of like a night dress to me. But it is really cute. The flowers are nice. We've got this one, which looks like it belongs in cottage living. <laughs> but very cute. It's nice to get that style out, outside of cottage living a little bit. Which is cute. I like this a lot. This looks like something my mom wore when I was in like elementary, middle school. My mom used to wear stuff like this. So I like this a lot. It reminds me of like my mom's church clothes <laughs> on Sundays when we were kids. Kids. it's great so that's cute a lot of variety like there's definitely a vibe where it's all very chill very comfortable but it's still a good variety of there's some different styles so i like that um we've got these sort of why can't i think of the word quilted quilted pants <laughs> that's the word um we got a skirt it's also that same sort of quilted thing um it's okay again these are like these aren't bad or anything it's just not really my style these are kind of cool these pants i like the white outline that's very familiar i can't think of why it's familiar to me like what fashion it is but it's it's familiar <laughs> 
So I like those. They look good. I like the shiny buttons. Very nice. Some pleated pant. These look pretty good. It's nice. So you can have some nice new like casual dress pants. It's nice. So we've got these ones. Nice and simple. We've got these new jeans, which are nice. They look very much like mom jeans. So I like them. And I would actually use these because they've got like a nice texture. The bottom looks nice. But, like there's a lot of EA jeans that I wouldn't touch, but these ones look nice. The skirt's pretty nice too. Again, it's sort of at that weird level that all EA stuff is at. So it's not my favorite, but it's a good looking skirt. Like I can tell that it's painted, but it doesn't bother me the way their painted stuff usually does. So it's it's done well enough for me to like it, which is good, good accessories. Ooh, got some leggings. These are cute. All right, for this one, the painting's not as good, especially like on these lighter ones, the edges don't look very good to me. I get this one in particular. I just, I really don't like the way the shadows look at the edges of those, but otherwise, um, nice. The style's cute. I like that they give pockets. Even EA, who is so terrible, knows that women need nice big pockets. <laughs> anyway shoes no shoes okay so we got six hairs for guys oh so we got six for guys eight for girls so it's a little unbalanced but not as bad as usual oh we got these new braids which are pretty cute then we've got these two hairs which are the same as the feminine frame and this one oh so all the other ones are the same okay cool we have different braids so feminine frame got the bun and masculine gets these ones so we got this new facial hair Oh, it actually looks really nice. I and mean, it pokes out a little bit, but other than that, it looks really nice. And it's a nice curly texture too, so. But again, I have the same sort of problem with this as I did with the hairs. It's just, again, it's locking culture behind the price wall. This is only the second curly beard we have. So anyone who has a curly beard, which I mean, a lot of different, a lot of different cultures have it. It's not specifically black culture. A lot of cultures have curly beards. So it's a little disappointing to see this locked behind the price wall. Oh, wait, there's something weird going on with his cheek. Do you see that right in there? There's like a weird pixel corner thing. That's weird. Okay. So those are my two problems. <laughs> There's some weird pixelation, but also I hate that it's behind the price wall. So for masculine, we only have this one. We don't get this. We don't get the, um, what is the word? <laughs> I can't think of it. Oh, I can't my brain work. The head scarf. Jeez. I'm sorry, my brain is just fried. I've been pretty overwhelmed <laughs> in my personal life, which is one of the reasons it's taken me forever to get back to The Sims. But like when I get overwhelmed, everything just shuts down, including my brain. So my brain just doesn't work. So <laughs> that's sort of where I'm at right now. So nothing's really working properly. So I'm sorry about that. They don't get the earring. So that's kind of disappointing. Makeup again, nothing. So we've got a new plaid shirt. It's okay. Clarence seems to like it. <laughs> I don't have any problems with it. Let's put it that way. I would still choose my custom content over this but it doesn't look bad like it's it's not bad it's definitely a well done thing this shirt very grandpa to me <laughs> i'm sorry this is like instantly it feels like he hunched over a little bit <laughs> he put this shirt on i it just this feels like a grandpa to me but it, it looks nice and we got this one looks very comfy I like the plaid underneath i like the tight plaid it's good oh and they've got a couple that don't have plaid as well which is nice but the sweaters look very comfy which is everything you want from a sweater looks great this shirt which i think is the one the dad wears in the trailer all right that's kind of cool this looks great look at that fleece pattern that looks fantastic again the painting is pretty good oh oh i'm so happy this is what i like to see look at that look at that little gap that's what i want to see i love that okay <laughs> but that looks great strings are actually separated the pocket is not but the pocket still looks pretty good oh wait actually hold on ooh, ooh. it's got a little it's got a little something on the lip that's good i, I like that this is nice this is nice you see i'm fangirling over this shirt now <laughs> Like legitimately just turning it and seeing that little gap, that makes me so freaking happy. You don't understand. This is like my biggest thing when it comes to clothes. I love the separation. I love when you can actually see the texture of the clothes. That's like my favorite thing. So I'm, I, I am very happy with this. <laughs> Let's check the other swatches though. We got a couple different patterns, which is cool. But yeah, it's nice. I'm, I'm very happy with this one. This looks super cute as well. Oh, look at that fold. Look at that fold. Oh, I love it. Okay, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm very happy. <laughs> can you tell? Can you tell how giddy I'm getting right now? I, I'm tired as well, which is why. So this will be a fun video because <laughs> I'm tired and it's showing um, already at four o'clock. Great. <laughs> but anyways, um, this looks pretty good. I like it a lot. But that fold, that fold right there, man, looks good looks real good oh my god look how good this guy looks his new beard new hair cool hat like ugh, i love this man i love it oh i didn't check the swatches oops my bad i forgot 
So, um, swatches look good. Okay, so we got a couple color block ones and a couple stripes. Nice. Okay, we've got this thing, which again reminds me of something from like Throwback Fit. Again, it's super, it's nice because we've got the like range of style. These are super nice, really nice. I like the pattern. Again, zipper, look at, look at that texture, looks good. Pockets got some lift, love it. I'm so happy, I am so happy. <laughs> this stuff looks so good. Okay, we got a new t-shirt, um, this one's pretty basic. It, this sort of looks like it accompanies the um, elephant shirt for feminine frame sense, but of course it doesn't have any elephants, which makes me a little sad. But I don't know, this one's nor this one's a regular shirt, whereas that one's knitwear, which I find interesting. Uh, we've got so the bowler shirt, the bowler shirt. <laughs> it's just uh, oh, fun. Okay, these the flaps I like very much. I'm very I'm so happy with the texturing, guys. Oh, this sweater is beautiful. I literally have I literally downloaded CC that looks like this sweater. This is this is well done. I'm so I'm very happy. This is something I would download if it was CC. That's I can say that about a lot of stuff in this pack, which I don't usually say about EA stuff. So, that's like the highest praise I can give. <laughs> Like if this was CC, I would download it. That's that's what we're saying right here. This this pack, the cast in this pack is really good. I'm very happy with this cast, honestly. And like we're not even to the main part. We aren't even to the kids yet. We aren't even to infants yet. Oh my god. I'm so excited. I'm like, oh, there's actually a lot of tops for masculine frame sims too. <gasps> Guys, we got more tops for masculine sims than feminine sims. <gasps> Bruh, I like that. I'm excited. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nice. And these are so dad too. Polos. It's like all my dad wears. Polos. Oh my god. I love these. And this cute hoodie. I like this hoodie a lot. Again, good texturing in the pocket and stuff. Oh, that strap. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at the gap. Look at the gap. Oh my god, guys. I. Am so I, 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 oh my god. I'm in, I'm, oh. there were so many things I was irritated about. <laughs> like, the, I'm so irritated about a lot of stuff being locked behind the paywall. But bro, this cast alone, I, I would, I would pay the $40 just for the cast. Like, but that's neat. I'm, I'm, I'm ridiculous. Okay. I, I waste my money a lot. Okay. So I don't, <laughs> don't, don't take my advice on that. But seriously, I, this would be an impulse buy instantly just for this cast. I'd be like, yeah, I could spend $40 on that. Like, look at the gap. Look at the gap. I, I'm, I'm so happy. We aren't even to the rest of the pack yet. I haven't even looked at the world yet. And I, uh, oh my God, I'm so happy. <laughs> so happy again nice zipper this one actually lift off this one actually lifts off look at that zipper Does the other one have zipper like that oh how are you gonna do that to me how are you gonna show me how beautiful it could be and not do it on the other ones oh that makes me a little sad but look how good that zipper looks bro look at that look at the lift look at the lift oh my god i'm so excited i'm <laughs> just <laughs> i'm giddy with excitement <laughs> at the moment but again, this is like something my dad would wear. I mean, not quite this pattern. His would be more just like basic stripes. I think, I, I'm pretty sure my dad has one that's like this color, but like basic stripes going down it. So again, these are all very dad to me. These are all really nice. These are very much reminding me of my dad, who is now a grandpa. So technically these are a grandpa too. But yeah, these are all so nice. These look good. Look at the lift. Look at it. Oh, I love that. I love it. I'm so happy with this. Guys, I'm so happy. And like the, the patch looks good too. Like it's painted on, but it still looks good. Love it. Got this one. Again, patch looks great. Oh, we've got the lift on the shoulders too. The sweater vest actually separates from the shirt. Love to see it. Got some good swatches. Oh, this one's cute. Oh, and this matches the feminine sweater too. So you could be like matching. Oh my God. I hope they have a lot of that. I hope they have a lot of matching stuff across all ages so that you could be like family photo day and just have everybody wear the same sort of thing oh my god that would be that would make me so happy um this is cool okay we don't have a gap but they are still lifted off so i'm still happy this lifts nice got some cute one all looking good like it and we've got this one. Oh, oh, oh! hold on hold on hold on look at the gap oh my god <laughs> i was so happy guys you don't even i i'm fangirling right now <laughs> overcast like uh, I, I i bet i sound so freaking ridiculous right now but this legitimately makes me so freaking happy <laughs> i love this it's so good this looks so good and i'm like guys got more tops than girls that doesn't happen in this game that's so cool i just i love it and everything looks nice there's lots of good stuff i love this i love this top it's really cute oh you only got one full body though. Yeah, that's why they had to do so many tops. They had to make up for it. Okay, a little bit of a 
dash to my heart, but it's okay. This still looks good. Look at that zipper. Look at that zipper. Wait, hold on. The pants. Mmm. These don't look very good. Oh, that makes me kind of sad. That makes me sad. All the other strings and stuff look so good. And then these ones are just like, this is like back to regular EA. <laughs> this is regular, <laughs> this is regular grade. <laughs> it's not as good as everything else. Oh, that makes me kind of sad because everything else was doing so well with the painting. And then we get to this and it's just like, those those don't look very good. They're, they're flat. You know, it's not that big of a detail. The, the zipper looks really nice and that pulls my eye more than those. So it's not terrible. Oh, that looks really good. That zipper looks great in this swatch. Uh, we got some bottoms. Not a lot of bottoms, huh? Oh, it's the same amount as feminine, I guess. But it just, it just seems like so little because we had so many tops, I think. But yeah, this matches that one hoodie thing that I liked. Um, zippers. Zippers look nice. They're painted on, but they still look nice. The patch looks nice. Um, we've got the same shorts. The same, like, padded shorts. It's cool. Uh, we got pants. Oh, no. <laughs> the pants are going to be the downfall of the male cast. <laughs> Why did these two lift off, but this one doesn't? I... Why? <laughs> Why? Why does that lift and that lift, but that does it? I, like, all or nothing, guys. Like, why? <laughs> Why? Why two of three? <laughs> Okay, I don't really like this style of pant anyway, so it's not like I would have used them that much anyways, but, you know, sad. Okay, <laughs> then we've got these ones, which is the same thing as the feminine ones. They lift on both sides, I can't quite tell. Yeah, they lift on both sides, that's good. <laughs> Everything's the same. <laughs> uh, these look pretty good. It looks, it's like, it's weird, like, drop crotch though. It looks so low, like, it should be up, like, a little bit higher. Okay. Okay, I feel weird because I keep like going right around his crotch, but there's a lot of details that are issues in there. <laughs> but yeah, um, it just it feels like that should be higher. It doesn't feel like it should be so low. Oh, same with these. Why would it be that low on jeans? That's so low. Cause like these ones look fine, but that that's so low. Why? Oh, I don't like that. I don't like how low they go. That's so weird. Cause like this isn't really the type of pant you would consider a drop crotch pant you know like there are pants that are made to look drop crotch this doesn't oh disappointment disappointment again you showed me how well you could do strings on the hoodies and then you fall off on the pants here just because a lot of your shirts cover that doesn't mean you should skimp out on it that makes me sad the pocket looks good though like it's painted but it still looks good but these strings the dangles look okay but the the loops look a little yeah i don't really like the loop like this is drop crotch too but it's not as it doesn't look as bad as that one. Ugh, I don't know. This one in particular really bothers me how low that is. And this one, is that lower? Yeah, this one is so much lower, even than these. Look at that. Oh, I, ugh. Uh, yeah, okay. The pants are definitely a downfall. <laughs> um, I'm not a big fan of the pants for um, masculine frame sims. Uh, but anyways, no leggings for guys, which is unfortunate. Guys can wear leggings. Come on. Let's go to the kids now. So we got the same sort of skin details. We get the freckles. Doesn't look like we get the moles though. So kids don't get moles, which is interesting. Um, we've got the same heart thing, of course, which makes sense. Should be able to get it. So we've got the missing teeth, which is cute, but it looks like the kids will probably always pull out the same tooth then, which is fine. That makes sense for the animation and stuff. That's cool. So you can get a different version for each one. So that's nice. We got the same forehead scar and chin scar. So kids can actually have scars now, which is nice. Didn't That wasn't available before. For hair, we only got three for kids. Oh, wow. Okay. I would have thought they had like maybe the bun version like a, or something similar to the buns or just like the pushed back one, the one with the headband. That's very much like a kid look to me. Huh. I'm surprised they didn't bring those down, but okay. We've got these three, which are fine, so, which means masculine sims will probably only have those two. The new bike helmet. Um, got a couple just colored ones, a couple patterns. Cute. Oh, there's lemons. Oh, ladybug. Cute. Got two new necklaces. That's weird. This, okay, this one's weird. The way it looks from the front, it looks like these should be like beads, you know, like an actual glass ball. But then when you turn it, it looks like they're stuck onto like a flat piece of ribbon or something. It's very strange looking. Oh, but like if it wasn't for the, the weirdness of the texture, it'd be really cute. But these are super cute, especially this one. I like this one with all the different colors. Oh, this one's cute too. But it's the same sort of thing. There's this like flattened out beads. It's very strange looking. Very very, very much a kid necklace which I like we need it we need more kids jewelry so we got some skin details so we can get freckles and stuff for our kids as well we get body moles for kids so why do kids get the body moles but not the face mole I don't understand <laughs> I'm so confused whatever okay so we've got this top again it is it's something that matches I like these <laughs> there's definitely matching stuff but 
like between the age groups I like that a lot it's so cute um we've got this cute little thing so adorable love the elephant okay we've got this one double collar nice both collars stick up I like that looks cute I love the striped ones they look so adorable that's actually really cute and it looks so comfy too I love how it bags up at her wrist nice lots of texture for this and this this like matches the masculine top as well I guess so there must be a feminine one that's similar and I'm just not thinking of it these are cute I like the little pattern ones like the little like mountains and stuff it's cool got these little patterns which are cute we got this one again just cute oh it's cute the little bird <laughs> oh it looks so like it's such a chunky bird i like it super cute and then we've got this top which is sort of like the mandarin collar i think um i still didn't look that up after yesterday's video <laughs> i was i still don't know if that's if that's correct if that's what those colors are called or not i don't remember i'm sorry got two dresses we got this one which is super cute little strawberry dress oh you can get owls too oh okay that's super adorable and then there's three swatches that don't have anything and then we've got overalls which look super cute the painting's not bad on these like they don't look terrible i don't feel like it's quite as good as the stuff i was raving about before but it's not bad and the buttons do actually have a little bit of lift to them which i like sorry that's like the biggest detail for me a lot of people probably don't even care about it but it's like it's such a big deal to me anyways swatches are nice the textures look good with the different colors and stuff so i like that a lot i like the pattern ones more i think they're cuter for bottoms we've got a couple things we've got some new short again this match the sort of like track outfits for the rest of the family we've got these jeans which look cute they drop a little bit on her too but it's nowhere near as bad as on the dad it's like on the dad it'd be like way down here yeah so these these are cute it's the same style of jean so the pair the fa whole family can wear mom jean style i like that We've got some cargo pants for kids too pockets don't lift on these which makes me a little sad but it doesn't look bad like the painting doesn't look bad so i'm not too mad about it these jeans these shorts look great the texture on these is fantastic and then we've got these ones which again very cute i think those strings are just painted on though yeah they're just painted on but they don't look bad like they don't look as great as some of the other painted textures but they don't look terrible so check accessories so we got a little bracelet it's a cute little bracelet it's got like a little penguin on it it's got some decent swatches oh so it's not always a penguin there's some different ones we got a pig or I think it was a chicken. Yeah, cute. Um, no shoes again. Oh, so we actually get three because we still get three for the masculine kids because the masculine kids get their braids. Well, at least they get their braids. We have the same helmet. No accessories for masculine sims. Looks like all the same shirts. Yeah, all the same. Okay, so we missed out on one shirt. There's one shirt that's feminine only, but otherwise we got all the same things, which I'm not mad about. Uh, the idea of them getting the same stuff makes me happier than one getting a bunch and one not getting a lot. The same overalls, but we don't get the other one with the strawberry dress. Um, Same pants. Did we get all the same pants? Okay, yeah, it's all the same. Nice. We don't get the accessories. That's everything for masculine sims. All right, let me go to toddlers. Toddlers only get two hairs. We get the braids and the short hair. No hats. We do get some new glasses though. <laughs> cute. That's so cute. Oh my god. So babies get new glasses. We get a new couple new shirt. We got this cute little sweater vest which looks fantastic. Love all the lift. Cute swatches too. We got some argyle ones, some plain ones, some striped ones. All good. All right. We got this cute little bomber. These are all super cute. The symbol changes a little bit on the, the lapel if it has one. Ooh, I like that one. This is what my kid would wear. <laughs> the black and white. <laughs> <laughs> we've got a duck shirt cute oh there's some other stuff too okay cute these are cute i like these they're just it's simple it's just simple basic but it's really cute i like it no full body that's a little sad what the hell caper what's wrong with your stomach that's from the glasses so um the glasses cut your kid in half apparently that's fun let's go god that looks so weird okay I, I, I gotta take those off i can't that looks so weird it's bothering me so much so we've got these pants which are kind of cute little basic things got the cute little sparkle patches on the side very nice there's a couple that don't have the patches it looks like these ones down here got these shorts which look like the same ones that the kids had um the laces look pretty good not not mad about them um these pants are cute those are cute i like those accessories we got some new socks little animal face socks now when are we gonna get socks like this for adults because i would love these i would wear these oh toddlers got shoes nobody else did <laughs> well we don't know about infants yet but toddlers got shoes um they're just cute little like general shoes i like them very cute i'll use these all the time those look great okay and then i'm assuming they got the same skin details as everybody else 
Yeah, toddlers can get freckles and they've got the same things and they can get the body moles. So toddlers as well can get the freckles but not the moles, which is interesting. I really don't know why the face moles don't show up for kids and toddlers. It's strange. All right, so they only have the two hairs as well. It's whatever. Um, we get the same glasses. They also cut the girls in half. No sexism here. Everybody gets chopped in half. Okay. Oh, we have one less jacket. So the feminine frame sims don't get the sweater vest. It's an interesting choice because like. I, I don't know. I just don't feel like that needed to be a gendered piece, but okay. We got two full body. Oh, oh, oh my god. There's a face on it. That's so cute. Oh, and there's a couple without it too. So if you actually wanted to look like formal or something, that's fine. <laughs> look how cute. Okay. They're cute. Super cute. Oh my god. I love it. I love it. I love it. Look at it. It's so freaking cute. Oh my god. So adorable and there's lift I love it oh my god okay look at oh my god look at that look at how it cuts up under that looks so good okay so freaking cute the bottoms we have the same three as the masculine ones same sock Ooh, toddler girls get two shoes Ooh -hoo. they get sandals Oh, cute. Uh, so we have those and then the same runners as the masculine ones got. All right, and now on to infants. We get to see new infant content. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm still mad that these don't work for other ages. Like the, the strawberry, I'm still salty about it. Like, why can't I have a strawberry? Anyways, let's deal with these noisy babies. Uh oh, so we don't get freckles for kid for babies either i mean for infants yeah i mean infants don't really have freckles so i guess that makes sense you usually adopt you usually get those when you're older but like moles i feel like you can be born with moles i feel like i was born with my mole i don't know i don't i don't know i don't know, I don't know anything about kids <laughs> anyways they still get the birthmark which just makes sense but um we don't get any of the other stuff can't get the scars for babies though the new um head and skin and chin scar you can't get i don't understand and you get three new hairs oh my god this is like my nephew's hair. This is like legitimately my nephew's hair. It's at the very top, it's curly, and then everywhere else it's like just little straight wisps. Oh my god. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, now we've got this one. This is cute too. And then we got another flatter one. Okay, yeah. Okay, not bad. I don't mind them. This one's my favorite though, just because it reminds me of my nephew. Oh, look at this hat. Oh my god, I love it. It's so cute, and the texture looks really nice too. That's so adorable. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, uh, we got some new glasses. I wonder why these ones didn't get a strap. Because, like, the base game regular glasses have a strap. Do baby sunglasses not get strapped? Are they less likely to take their sunglasses off? They want to stay cool? Again, I don't know anything about baby. No tops. Not a single top. Interesting. Um, let's check skin details. We get the moles. Okay. We get body moles. But again, no face moles. No body freckles. No body or face freckles, actually. Okay, interesting. No tops. But eight full body oh my god look at the little duck it's so cute oh my god it's so adorable oh red eyes you got a little demon duck i love it you got this little onesie which is nice with little striped sleeves I swear infants make so much more noise than everybody else they're so they move around and make so much noise always says shut up shut up cole you're being kind of annoying i don't know that something looks weird oh never mind it makes sense now it makes sense now. You see that shine? Okay. It's like vinyl. Got it. Got it. Never mind. I rescind my insult. This, it's a cute, again, um, it's back to the not great painting that the strings don't look as good as the other stuff they did in this pack, so I'm a little disappointed there. But this is super cute. Got this sweater, which is cute. Very cute. I like the swatches. Uh, we got this onesie, which is super adorable. Well, I guess it's not a onesie, it's a set. It's like a top, it says sweatshirt and sweats. Oh, that's so cute. Look at the little, oh my God. Look how cute. Oh, that's so adorable. Oh, oh my God, it's a hedgehog. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm gonna lose my mind. I love it. I love it so much. <laughs> I love it so much. Oh, those are so cute. Okay. Uh, we got this little sunshine shirt, which is very cute. Oh, and you can do rain too. You can be a sunny baby or a rainy baby. I like it. Okay, we got this. <laughs> it's pandas. <laughs> I love pandas. Oh my god. Okay, that's super cute. Okay, I got it in a couple different colors. We got some with some fruit. <gasps> sharks! I love sharks. Okay, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I love sharks. I think they're so cool. I mean, they're terrifying and I don't ever want to be in the water with one, but they're so cool. Um, so this, I love this. <laughs> Aside from demon duck here, 
this is probably my favorite. Like Demon Duck, Demon Duck. Like look at Demon Duck. Look at look at those eyes. I love it. But aside from that, this is probably my favorite because it has sharks and pandas, which are my favorite animals. I love it. <laughs> Anyways, bottoms none, which doesn't surprise me because we didn't get any tops. <laughs> the little shark smile i love it okay um no accessories no shoes okay toddlers are the only ones to get shoes apparently oh we get an extra hair for feminine we get another one of these little things which is cute like in base game you get the one that like sticks off over here so you get like a straight top of the head one for this one hats we get the same hat which is so cute i love this hat we're just gonna leave her in this hat because it's so adorable uh got the shades no shirt a uh, couple more tops so Looks like all these ones down here are the same, so we just have these three at the top that are different. So we've got this one here. It's very cute. Little flowers are nice. A pretty pattern. Uh, we've got the little cat ones here. Oh my god. They're so cute. Oh, and you can have dogs too. Cats or dogs. I love it. Oh, this is so cute. And the collar looks nice too. It's got a nice lift to it. Um, and the painting for the buttons looks amazing. Like, those buttons look great. This one, very nice. Buttons don't look as nice, but it still looks good. These are great. There's a lot of, definitely, like, crossover between the styles. So you can definitely do family outfits, which I like. Um, so again, no pants, no accessories, no shoes. All right, so that is all the cats. That took me so long. I'm sorry. Hey, editing Jessica here. So I was originally planning on doing a, a little bit more in this video, which is what you'll see me doing here. I was like going to talk about the new um, likes and dislikes stuff. And then I was actually going to go and do the whole build by and I recorded all that stuff and it's all in there, but um, I'm not doing that. It's already 1240 AM on Friday and I started recording at like 330 on Thursday. So uh, uh, no, I I'm so tired. I I can't, I can't do it anymore. I'm so tired. I need to go to bed. The giddiness has passed. I am in full, I'm gonna pass out in any second mode. So <laughs> I'm done for tonight. This video has gone on so long and I'm so sorry. It's probably not even worth it. It's like, but I, I just, I'm too tired to care. So it's going up. So I am gonna finish this up and upload it and I will do the build by probably later today, I guess, <laughs> when I wake up today. So yeah, um, hopefully, that will actually get out to you guys before the day ends unlike this one that didn't get out on thursday when i planned it so yeah uh, anyways I, i'm done i'm i'm just i'm done <laughs> so i'll see you in the next one bye